And we're back. Oh, right away, thanks. Um, does anyone need help? No, we don't, because we just got a safe one. Cool. <coughs> well, that one's dead. Nope, wrong one. This and this. Get her some more stats. Accuracy, she doesn't really need accuracy, but okay, whatever then. Uh, uh, excuse me. More agility is nice, she doesn't need that though. Him right here, then. Yeah. And then. Yeah. Yep. Alright, so where is she at? Luck by four? I don't really know what luck does, but okay. I'm 
gonna go. I'm gonna get all this first. So you unlock this one. We're good on that stuff for now. Then we're going to move. To right here for now. Then we're going to. All of this stuff. And then we'll move. We'll get the mana later. Fortune, whatever that does, who knows. We'll actually move right here. This. Then we'll move back to here. This one? Nope. And then we'll move to here. And get some more magic defense and some more magic for her. And then we'll move over to here. And get some more mana. Is everyone done? Yes, they are. Cool. Alright, we're set. Let's move on. Fair enough. But I do have this. This may not work though, we'll see. Wearing off now, that's fine. We'll do it until we can no longer do it, and then we'll use Veil Force special ability. This boss is like a Mack truck. We won't need Veil for special weather. Nice. Perfect.
praise be to Yevon. That's what I would have said, if I was a follower of Yevon. We were all there, and in one piece. Even if I had a headache from wondering what was in store for us next. Aren't we? Look, that's the bottom of the temple. <sighs> We've fallen a long way. What now, I wonder? What now? Uh, you act first and think later, don't you? I mean, can't you be a little more responsible? We're all depending on you, you know? A lecture. No, no, no. <laughs> Just a suggestion. You should place trust in your friends. But you can't expect someone to protect you all the time. You would do well to remember that. Is that a lecture? It's advice. Sound advice, too. <sighs> hey, Waka, would you cheer up? Uh, look, we only did what we had to do. It doesn't matter. Don't you see? I've always walked the path of Yevon. But now, I'm a traitor. How could this happen? Damn! It's not Riku's fault, either. Huh? <sighs> you don't know how I feel. I'm sure Yuni's okay. She's breathing fine and all. How are Lulu and Waka? Hmm. Well, Waka's in shock. Can't blame him either. And Lulu? Well, she's just the same as always. She's so together. All grown up, I guess. I guess. Well, just give me five or six more years. So, Kamari, how do we get out of here? Hey, don't change the subject. We climb. Kimari too. Only those who try will become. Huh? I think he means you have to work hard if you want to be like Lulu. Oh, I will. Kimari think Riku should stay Riku. Huh? Hey, are you saying I'll never be like Lulu? Kimari! <laughs> How can you laugh at a time like this? Yuna? I wanted to confront Maester Seymour about his father, Lord Jiskel. I wanted to convince him to turn himself in to Yevon's judgment. In exchange for marriage? Yes, if that's what it took. So, what did Seymour say? He didn't say anything. Now, I, now I don't even think it was worth it. I should have told you what I was going to do. Enough. Dwelling in the past is futile. Hey, you don't have to say it like that. You want to waste time listening to her regrets. You don't have to say it like that. Our immediate concern is Yuna's pilgrimage. Are you willing to go on? Yes. But then, do you think Yevon will allow it? 
The Faith are the ones that give power to the Summoners. Not the Temples or the Teachings. If the Temples try to stop us, then we will defy Yevon if we must. Whoa! I can't believe you said that! Sir Oren? Count me out. We have to atone, to make up for the sins we have committed. Of course. It's not like I ever liked Maester Seymour, ya? Yeah? No way I'll ever forgive him for killing Lord Jisco. And for trying to do us all in two, you know? But still, the bunch of us going against Yevon? No way! But still, we have transgressed and must face our punishment. We must go to Bevel. We must speak with Maester Micah and explain what has happened. There is no other way, I think. I agree. Uh, Sir Oren? So it is decided. Will you come with us? I am the troublemaker, after all. Yeah, that's right. You can always count on Aaron to complicate things. Yeah! Kamari roars and Aaron runs off, and... I never asked you to follow me. Hey, but that's what friends are for. Right? Yep. Thank you. Huh? Friends, huh? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Man, how can you all act like nothing's wrong? Must got nerves of steel or something. You're too edgy. Listen to the hymn and calm down. Is that coming from the temple? Yes, it is Yevon's gift. It soothes the hearts of the faithful. I saw an item over there somewhere. Like a chest, but I don't know if I can get it or not. Nah. Jack used to sing this song. <laughs> yeah, over and over. <laughs> but not this good, that's for sure. Another trait you share. Uh, what? You were listening? Can I get a little privacy? Your singing reminded me of Spira. All right, you're not originally from Xanarkin, are you? You homesick? Maybe. Say, how'd you get to Xanarkin anyway? Sin? Uh-huh. I thought so. That proved it. Sin was the link between Xanarkand and Spira. Which means, if we kill Sin, I'll never be able to go home. Where is this chest, I wonder? Hmm? Oh well. The singing stopped. <gasps> There's something here! The crown. Then I knew that Sin really was my old man. For the first time, I was finally able to believe it. The song you were listening to. What is it this time? <clears throat> Thank you. 
Xanarkand. Ah, you homesick too? That's not your world anymore. You're sin now. Hey, I'm older now, you know? I know. You want this to end. I'll find a way, promise. I forgive you this time. Be good for a while, okay? Is there an item in the water? Hold up. Yeah, there is. Oh, I don't really need those, but hey, whatever. Alright. 